Hello, this is Lakshmi Kantiwari. In this tutorial, we will try ground a Motorola 360 smartwatch and we will see what Motorola 360 is having inside. So it is equipped with the Android here and uh, it has ambient light sensor which helps to screen automatically adjust to the surrounding brightness and uh, it has a multi faces and the dial so that the user can just sweep to change these faces and dials. It battery runs up to one day to 1.5 day depends on the user and uh, it is first smartwatch which supports the wireless charging and it has an optical heart rate sensor inside this uh, smartwatch and it has a bluetooth and wi-fi connectivity so that if you are not at the home and you can get connected with your watch directly with, to your mobile devices if we discuss about the technical specification of Motorola 360 watch, it has a TI OMAP 3 processor, 4 GB internal storage and 512 MB RAM and it supports 1.56 inch backlit LCD display with the resolution of 320 to 290 and it has 205 pixels per inch and uh, it is a circular display. It has support for Bluetooth 4.0 as well as a Wi-Fi support. It has a pedometer, optical heart rate monitor, ambient light sensors and vibrator motor and dual microphone support. And here is a wireless charging stand. And if you open it and you will find that here the inside it has a ribbon here. So any smartwatch have these ribbons so that it can make the, it as a waterproof. And here it has a battery, it is 3.8 volt lithium ion polymer battery and uh, its uh, rating is 300 milliampere hour and uh, it supports 1.1 uh, watt hour energy and if you compare it with the Samsung and LG smartwatches, Samsung gear have 3.8 volt 300 milliampere hour battery and uh, LG smartwatch have 3.8 volt and 400 milliampere hour battery rated at 1.5 watt hour of energy and here is a motorola 360 have a, a coil which supports its inductive charging inside it so if you place this uh, motorola on a wireless stand wireless charger stand so it uh, it receives charging from this coil first of all it have a texas instrument tms320 fixed point digital signal processor it has a 512 MBS RAM, it is made by Micron Technology and it has a 4GB uh, 9 flash made by the Toshiba THGB MA5 and it has a Texas Instruments USB 2.05 transceiver, it has Atmel capacitive touch screen controller and also it has Texas Instrument AFE 4490 integrated analog front end for pulse oximetry so this chip is responsible for measurement of heart and the SpO2 and also it has Watson microelectronics uh, uh, analog silicon microphone and also it has a Texas Instrument uh, TMU processor power and uh, Texas Instrument BQ 5.051B integrated wireless power lithium ion battery charger and uh, Wirelink WL1831 Wi-Fi and Bluetooth module it is dual band so it has wi-fi and uh, bluetooth in a single chip and also it has a SysTech uh, uh, mipi display interface controller and invention mpu60516 axis gyroscope and accelerometer motion tracking device and uh, here if you remove this uh, and you can find here it is a texas instrument omap 3 application processor Thank you so much for watching this tutorial and stay tuned with us and subscribe this channel so that you can get directly update in your inbox.